How to break free from nine common bad money habits. Nobody ever said that managing finances was easy. But it is possible for everyone to change bad habits. It takes discipline, dedication, and knowledge to learn how to take control of your finances. In this video I will be discussing 9 of the most common bad money habits that hold people back and tips on how to break free from them. We will also explore ways to build wealth and the best strategies to pay your taxes so that you can make the most of your money. Paying yourself first is one of the most important aspects of taking control of your finances. It means that as soon as your paycheck comes in, you take 10% of it and put it into a savings account. By doing this, you will guarantee that the money will be saved and won't slip through your fingers. This habit can be difficult to start, but it's essential to building wealth and taking control of your finances. The second bad money habit is getting comfortable with bad debt. It's easy to be lured in by marketing messages and to think that we need to buy certain things or go on certain holidays. Unless you can afford to pay for the thing with cash, don't buy it with any form of debt. The average credit card interest rate is 22%, which cancels out any rewards or benefits. If you're not able to pay off the debt as soon as possible, you'll end up losing money in the long run. The third bad money habit is not having a stockpile. Having a stockpile of 3 to 6 months of money gives you peace of mind and will help you cope with any unexpected expenses. You can start this by paying yourself first and allocating 10% of your paycheck to savings. Once the stockpile is built, you can use the additional money you save to invest in stocks or other investments. The fourth bad money habit is not knowing your income or expenses. It's essential to track your assets and liabilities, so that you have a clear goal of where you want to go financially and the steps you need to take to get there. This way, you can avoid lifestyle inflation, where your spending increases along with your income. The fifth bad money habit is having expensive hobbies. Expensive hobbies can drain your money and prevent you from building wealth. To avoid this, it's important to replace these expensive pastimes with other hobbies. If you want to spend a lot of money, focus on skills, experiences, or education that will add value and help you build wealth in the long term. The sixth bad money habit is not automating your savings. This means setting up a system that will transfer a certain amount of money from your checking account to your savings account. You can set up an automatic transfer on the day your paycheck hits your account or even split your paycheck into two accounts and have the second account be your savings account. Automating your savings ensures that you will save money without having to think about it. The seventh bad money habit is not minimizing your taxes. The government takes a big chunk of your income, so it's important to be mindful of what you can do to minimize your taxes. This could mean contributing to a 401k or IRA claiming deductions, or taking advantage of tax credits. Minimizing your taxes is a great way to keep more of your money in your pocket. The eighth bad money habit is not investing wisely. Investing is a great way to build wealth, but it's important to do your research and understand the different types of investments before you jump in. You should also make sure you have an emergency fund in place before investing in any type of risky investments. Investing wisely ensures that you are making the right decisions with your money and building wealth in the long run. The ninth bad money habit is relying too heavily on credit. Credit cards can be very useful when used responsibly, but they can quickly get out of hand if you're not careful. It's important to pay off your credit cards each month and to only use them for emergencies. Relying too heavily on credit can take away from your ability to save and build wealth. Managing finances is a continuous process and it takes dedication and knowledge to take control of your money. In this lecture, we discussed 9 of the most common bad money habits that hold people back and tips on how to break free from them. We also explored ways to build wealth such as automating your savings, minimizing taxes, investing wisely, and avoiding credit. I hope this lecture was helpful and I wish you luck in taking control of your finances. With discipline, dedication, and knowledge, you can take control of your finances and build wealth. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications for more videos like this. Also, be sure to check out our other videos as well. Thanks for watching.